I love the interview. I just finished watching it. I had to finish watching it all the way through. I highly recommend it. I'm going to do my best not to give away a lot of this movie, but I will say that it takes the image that we have of North Korean leader, dictator, Kim Jong-un, that was brought to us by Dennis Rodman and his trips and the videos of basketball presentations and the other activities he was doing over there with Kim Jong-un and their walks. And it takes the, that image and the one that you undoubtedly formed of Kim Jong-un and accelerates it to absurd, hilarious, and edgy levels and directions of political and social satire. It, let me put it this way, if any leader of any country were portrayed like Kim Jong-un was, the administration of that leader in that country would just go apeshit completely. So I can understand why there would be some in North Korea who would say, look, we don't like this movie because it, it paints a very insulting picture of Kim Jong-un. The most insulting picture presented of any leader of North Korea, and that includes Team America World Police. That makes Team America World Police look like some Saturday morning live action cartoon that's G-rated, forget it. This is definitely not G-rated, by the way. And it's got a lot of sight gags and sexual innuendos and outright simulated sex and it's a raunchy, it's a raunchy film on top of everything else. It's raunchy, it's bloody, it's nasty, it's gory, it's hilarious, it's funny, it's it's racist, it's Jesus, man. Wow, it's, but it is a movie that does what it was designed to do extremely well. Accelerated by the hackers who said that they didn't want Sony to distribute this movie. And now they've created a cult classic. Hats off to Seth Rogen and James Franco for creating a very daring work. Really, really is. And I highly recommend seeing it. It's worth renting or buying just to see what the fuss was about. And you're not going to come away disappointed. Look, this isn't the best movie you've ever seen in your entire life. But I guarantee you, you'll find moments that are absolutely funny in it. I guarantee that absolutely. Abs absolutely. You be the judge. I loved it. Be I, a lot of people, a lot of critics rather, were saying, it's not a good movie, it's not worth it. Those critics are completely wrong. It is worth it. In the context of all the swirl around the controversy, it's worth it. It really is. The Interview.